Today we are talking about Beethoven's sixth symphony, the Pastoral Symphony. Let's hear the first movement. beginning of the first movement. This symphony is not a normal symphony. It's a symphony with titles, like paintings in music. The first movement, awakening of cheerful feelings on arrival in the countryside. But nature and music is a very old story, for example, with Vivaldi, The Seasons. French Baroque composer Jean Ferry Rebel with Les Elements. But with Beethoven's, the plan is not to describe the nature. The plan is more to show the feelings that we, as human beings, we have. Uh, inside of the na nature or in contact with the nature. Let's do once again. Let's look once again how Beethoven's um, composed this beginning. In the low register, a fifth, an F and a C, and then a ritornello. But. This principle, low notes and ritornello, we know, for example, in folk instruments like bagpipe. Or also the French folk instrument like viella. also a principle that we can have in the mountains when we sing something and when there is an echo like a cannon. A double cannon with two melodies and later on in this first movement we have an amazing music when Beethoven composes um, a rhythmical combination and you have the feeling that you move, you move inside, for example, of a forest. Let's hear how it sounds. So, how does Beethoven do this, uh, this amazing moment in music? You have triplets music in three, and you have a ritornello in music in two. And the mix of the two rhythm makes this effect of we feel that we move inside of the nature. The second movement is another picture in music, seen by the brook. It's a very soft, melancholic music. The string players, they play long notes, slurred notes. We say in music legato. And this principle for sure is very famous in music. When we play legato, slur, it's like in Smetana, Moldau. of legato in the instruments, we can almost see the, the water flowing. And for sure, after that, we hear it again and again, and strangely, it's more important than the melody itself.
this legato figures, this texture be, becomes more important than the melody. The melody is just a resonance. And after that, for sure, we can imagine that's the spring, and the spring is now. And we can hear when we are in the, the land, we can hear the, the birds singing. So in Beethoven's orchestra, the birds are three instruments, the flute, the clarinet, and the oboe. The flute is a nightingale, the oboe is a quail, and the clarinet is the famous cuckoo. So, as always, I invite you to listen to this symphony, the whole symphony, for example, on YouTube, Beethoven by Arnaud Cour and the Chamber Orchestra of Europe. And we talked about the birds, the cuckoo, so let's maybe do a body clapping together with the French very famous song Coucou Ibu! Oh, <laughs> 